Jango Fett, was a famed Mandalorian human male bounty hunter and the clone template of the Grand Army of the Republic. Known as the best bounty hunter in the galaxy during the final years of the Galactic Republic, Fett was proficient in marksmanship as well as unarmed combat. The Mandalorian armor that he wore featured various weapons and gadgets, including a flamethrower, dual WESTAR-34 blaster pistols, and a jetpack. His personal starship was the FIRESPRAY-31, class patrol and attack craft, Slave I. Hailing from the planet Concord Dawn, Fett was a foundling of the Mandalorians trained by a mentor, and, as a Mandalorian warrior, fought in the Mandalorian civil wars before becoming a bounty hunter. As a bounty hunter, Fett worked with and became acquainted with several fellow hunters and individuals in the criminal underworld including the Duros Cad Bane, whom Fett once mentored, Aura Singh, Zam Wessel, and the infamous pirate Hondo Onaka. In time, Fett became widely regarded as the galaxy's best bounty hunter, with a notoriety matched by few other bounty hunters. Shortly after the invasion of Naboo, the Sith Lord Darth Tyrannus hired Fett to serve as the genetic foundation of an army secretly bred on the extragalactic world of Kamino. His DNA spawned millions of clone troopers who shared his face, voice, and were trained to become soldiers. As part of his payment, Fett was given an unaltered clone whom he raised as his son, Boba Fett. In the last days of the Separatist crisis, Fett was involved in the failed plot to assassinate Senator Padme Amidala on Coruscant. The Jedi Order investigated the incident, forcing Fett to leave the Kaminoan homeworld after he was confronted by Jedi Knight Obi-Wan Kenobi. Kenobi tracked Fett to Geonosis where he discovered the bounty hunter's connection with Count Dooku and the Confederacy of Independent Systems. Fett fought against the Jedi assault team during the First Battle of Geonosis, and was beheaded by Jedi Master Mace Windu in 22 BBY. His legacy survived not only through the millions of clone troopers that formed the backbone of the Republic military, but also Boba, who became a bounty hunter like his father before him. By the era of the Galactic Empire, Boba possessed the same set of Mandalorian armor worn by Jango, although its appearance had been altered significantly.